God's grace has continued to shine on Walsh University in 2009. As we reflect on our many blessings during this Christmas season, we encourage you to do the same in your own life. It has been another incredible year at Walsh. In June, we kicked off our 50th anniversary celebration of the university's founding. Many of you have joined in celebration of our 50th anniversary at our June kickoff event, the festive fireworks display in September, or the sold out black tie gala in October. And there's still more to come. We graduated nearly 600 in May, and this fall we celebrated our ninth consecutive record-breaking enrollment when we welcomed the 50th class, which was one of the largest freshman classes ever. We were blessed in October to host Rwandan genocide survivor and international best-selling author Imakule Ilibagiza to our campus. 3,000 people came to Walsh to hear her personal message of faith and forgiveness. And it was my honor to present her with an honorary doctorate. During this Christmas season, we turn our thoughts gratefully to all of you who have supported Walsh throughout the years and helped to make our progress possible. We say simply, but sincerely, thank you. With so much happening, one of the greatest gifts we can receive during the rush of the holidays is a quiet moment of reflection and peace. Please take this time now to reflect on your own personal joys and blessings while listening to the beautiful voices of our Walsh Chorale. On behalf of my wife, Terry, and everyone here at Walsh University, may God's blessing continue to touch your life and may the Christmas promise of hope fill your heart today and always. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Oh.